Welcome to Work Smarter TV. I am Maarten and in this video I'm going to show you how to use the scale to fit printing options in Excel. Um, we go first we have our data here and we have a graph as well a chart that we made of this data and we're going to see if we can get this nicely on a piece of paper. We go to file print and as you can see you get a preview here of all the pages. And now you can say you can use the scaling options here if we click the little arrow here and you can say fit sheet on one page. And as you can see it shrinks it until it's all in one page. Now this might be slightly on the small side for proper reading but you can. And you can say fit all columns on one page well that's uh, in this example that comes down to the same and you can say fit all rows on one page so as you can see it has all rows. In this case that's the same as no scaling but if, if you should you have the, not, uh, twice the amount of rows the, the same thing would happen then with this option. Now, of course, you can also say, well, I want to have a, have a landscape orientation. And I think, yes, that now if we do no scaling, yeah, then they don't all fit. And if we can say go to fit all rows, then you can see that it scales here quite nicely as well. Um, now, this one used to be, always used to be a pain in, uh, in Excel. And as you can see with these options, it's pretty easy. All right. I hope you found this video helpful. If you have any questions, you can leave them in the comments. You can also subscribe to, subscribe to my YouTube channel. And if you want to receive uh, uh, email updates when I post a new video and receive tips and tricks on how to use Excel in a smarter way, uh, you can click to the, on the uh, button in the bottom right corner of this video. This will take you to my website, worksmarter.tv, and you can subscribe to my mailing list there. Thank you for watching. Hope to see you next time. Bye-bye.